come here through the miracle of jurisdiction transformation. We're at the town line where Sharon and Walpole truly meet. The other encounter back up Route 1A, they merely kissed. And the agency of meeting is this charming little back country lane in Wall Street. It lives under the name of Pine Street, Walpole that is. And in Sharon, it suddenly becomes South Walpole Street. And it is our way over and under I-95. Ooh, and we found a blaze. Looky there, under the thickly settled 30 miles per hour thing. Nice. Tally ho. Yep. Another Pine Street, a Sharon version, meeting South Walpole Street, the beloved Blaze, Denny's indication of a turn. The blazing picks up in quality as we begin to investigate Sharon. And now we're on again. And we're at the confluence of the Warner Trail, Warner Trail, and the Bay Circuit. Just off of this Sharon Pine Street thing. Oh, there's another Warner Trail blaze with a Bay Circuit underneath it over there. So this is the beginning of a tremendous relationship. It's not long before we'll be in the Moose Hill complex. And here we are at the end of a private driveway. The property owners graciously consented to agree to an easement for hapless dingbat hikers like myself. And now we head into another patch of woods. Bit of actual rock climbing. Who knew? Good lord, I'm such an out of shape slob for this nonsense. Nonetheless, it's pretty damn pleasant. We're on Pierce Hill, and with any luck, I'm at the top of it and I get to descend soon. And this is where the trail comes out at Sharon's version of South Walpole Street, another busy little town arterial. There's our trailhead. And we head this way a little bit and we'll be entering Massachusetts Audubon Society's Moose Hill system soon.